And now that you mentioned that you also had like a situation where you had to deal with finance a bit, like mm-hmm. as a day job, yeah. do you have any investment strategies or do you just save, do you invest? Like what kind of like money moves do you do? Because in the States, I know if you make the perfect moves in investing in different things or mm-hmm. just how you put your money to multiply or yeah. get compound. Are there any strategies that you personally use to just make sure you're set for a slightly, you know, just like for, for those. A rainy day fund. Yeah, a rainy day fund. And yes. also like just in the future, because you never know you're investing in something so that it can grow and start. Because those opportunities are a lot in the States. Yeah. In Kenya, we are a bit limited with what we can invest in. Mm-hmm because we do have our traditional means, yeah. but not all of them are the best, especially mm-hmm. if you didn't get into land, Kitambo, and mm-hmm. our parents were there. Yeah. Now you see people who bought land and built, and their houses are just being ran over by a bulldozer. Yeah. Those oh. situations that happen. Mm-hmm. So, like, w- what investment kind of moves do you do, like, when you're in the States? Okay. So I have uh, investments in, like, index funds, and have a financial advisor, so oh, wow. you can definitely find that you will make a lot of money, like long term. Yeah. So if you keep like, or even IRA, like retirement accounts mm, or Roth, Roth IRAs, IRA. all of those are really good because you know your money is not being taxed, mm. and you're also making money over a period of time. Another okay. thing is, yeah, your guys, I like <laughs> this conversation now. Uh-huh. Is your personal credit? Yeah. And if you're if you have a business or an LLC, you can also really benefit from business credit. Mm. So the good thing about the US is that when you have good credit, the the bank just wants to give you money. Oh. Unprovoked, you're just like. So you have an idea for something. You just when you open up your LLC, you can definitely build up. When your personal credit is good, like mm-hmm. your credit score, you've worked on it. You don't owe a lot of money, or you're paying off your your credit cards. Yeah. You notice that your social your 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 uh, credit score credit is going score. up. Yeah. So when your personal credit score is going up, you're also growing your business credit score. And mm. th- with that, the banks are very, very quick to give you more money because they're seeing you're not only using the money, you're also paying it off. So okay. they're more willing to give you money to invest in, in further yeah. um, amounts of money in your business. So for example, let's talk about personal credit yeah. on its own. Mm. Once you have, like, let's say, anywhere and between 700... And don't worry, I won't ask your personal credit. So Good, because I won't tell credit you. Credit score. <laughs> Duta, what's your credit score? <laughs> no, 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 you don't have to say it. Yeah, <laughs> I was yeah. going to say it. Yeah. So okay, yeah, personal anywhere credit. between 700, 800, you're mm. in a good space because you're constantly being given a good amount of money mm. to invest and buy things like maybe a house an apartment, oh. like a structured building that you can be renting out. You live in one, you live in one building, and then you rent out the rest. Yeah. Then you're getting a constant income. That's oh. one way. For business credit, they'll give you lump sum. They'll give you two hundred and fifty thousand and tell you, tell us what you're going to use it with. And what? sometimes you can even be told you don't have to pay it all off. Oh. So you're paying off maybe a certain amount, and then the rest is for keeps. And you see that's Wait, really yeah. And they have forgiveness. They have loan forgiveness. Wait, you have to apply. Really? Yes. Hey, okay. So you have to just look hey, at I the, don't the, think we have that in Kenya. <laughs> we don't have that. Uh-huh. Yeah, so you just have to look at those um, avenues like the Roth IRAs, like I talked about, the business credit and your personal credit. Yeah. That's for me what has really come through for those days where I'm like, you know what, this paycheck to paycheck business is not working yeah. or I need a mental health break. So I want to take like a nice two weeks to think about what I want to do. Mm. I don't have to worry about not making rent. True. Yeah. 